Hey everybody, wanted to update y'all about what's going on with our straw bale build. Last time we checked in, I think it was a concrete pour day, which was quite a day. But since then, we've had a lot of progress, a lot of momentum, and we're moving ahead with the next steps. So after a couple days of leaving the forms on since the pour, we've taken that off, stacked them all for trusses and roof sheathing. We've also done some preliminary leveling on the floor, and we poured five interior 16-inch pier supports that will support the second story. Today, what we've done is started on the framing deck, which is an exciting process because this means that we have a level, flat, square surface to build our post and beam wall systems out of. So after two days of curing, we've ripped out the forms. This is 5 8 plywood, some of which we oiled, and we'll use that again for roof sheathing and box beam. Over here we got some trusses, and these are going to be the south wall facing um, away from the house. So today's a super exciting day because we finally got the framing deck done, which means we have a level surface to put the walls up on with. And it's a really empowering process because I know that anything laid on here will be level-ish and we're going to go up well with the walls. So the next steps are kind of exciting because we can call in our friends and community to help us frame these walls out, at which point we get to get the roof on and then it's bail time. So the real task now is getting all the framework done so we can get a roof on before any bales arrive. And that's an exciting process. We've got a few cedar posts to raise, some big beams. So there'll be some coordinating and there'll be some community efforts. And we're both really excited about this next steps. 